The views expressed by our guests in the following video are solely the opinions of our guests and do not necessarily reflect the views and or opinions of the Ola 7 podcast show. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello guys, my name is DJ Ola7 Owen. Oh, welcome to Dondo here on your number one podcast show in the land, the Ola7 podcast. And I'm your host, Ola Owen. Welcome to Dondo. Welcome to On The Spot, where we interview guests from all walks of life, politicians, entertainers, you know, um, business people, musicians, uh, athletes. Ah, you name them. We got one of my comedians. To know our host, but tonight we have got a special guest. He is a stand-up comedian, actor, and MC who's made a name, you know, for himself internationally. He has won multiple awards, including the 2019 Outstanding Comedian um, at um, the National Arts Merit Awards, and also the Pan African Comic of the Year at the Savannah Comic Choice Awards. He was also a crowd um, favorite in Steve Harvey's uh, stand-up spotlight. More recently, you know, he made it to the finals of the America's Got Talent in 2024. Uh, Let's welcome Lenmore John Nassi, yes. well, also known as uh, the Village Boy. The Village Boy. All the way from USA, <laughs> yes. United States of America. Yes. <laughs> Hello, my brother. How are you? Andre Boy. I'm, I'm happy to be hosting you today. Thank you for having me. I've always wanted to come here. Really? I, I'm like, I want to go to that show. <laughs> you're doing the best. <laughs> Thank I, you, man. You know, I appreciate you. Thank you, man. Yes. Finally, you're here. I'm here and I'm happy. And uh, I want to play, you know, uh, uh, one of your your, your, your <laughs> No, I don't want to hear myself. <laughs> why? I don't like to hear my voice. Why? I, I think you just on Twitter. I, yeah, yeah. I, I, I hate my voice. I yes, why. I'm like, ah, why? For no people, reason, though. People laughing. Why is this? <laughs> why people pay to watch, to watch me? <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to play this, um, uh, to play this clip. Mm -hmm. Listen to this one. Green card, you know, uh, I, I have um, almost the rights, you know, that you have as an American. Almost. Not all of them, but almost. For example, you see, I'm not allowed to vote, yeah, but I'm allowed to buy a gun. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. So technically, I'm not allowed to vote, but I can take away yours. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, why are you voting for a <laughs> Tell me! <laughs> You know, I'm voting in my own way. Okay, this is, that's how I vote. But I can't wait, man, to become a citizen, you know, you know, because I really want to vote. Because I want to vote for Trump. <laughs> Let me explain. See, because I'm from Zimbabwe. I miss corruption. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, I miss home, you know. <laughs> I just want to make America home again. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> It's a hit, Mdara. It's a hit, Mdara. <laughs> as it's a hit. Yes. You, you, you miss corruption. Tell me about that part. Okay. So this is what happens, right? Uh, in comedy, it's all about, it's psychological. Yeah. There's a way of saying, so, like, you can say one thing yeah. so many ways. Right. Right. Yeah. So when I talk about this corruption, I'm literally <laughs> telling them to their faces yeah. that you too mm -hmm. are corrupt. Oh. <laughs> oh, you too are corrupt. Exactly. It's, it's, it, it's, no, it's, not, it's not just the words I'm saying. Yes. It, there's a context behind it. Yes. There's always yes. context mm -hmm. behind everything that I say. Yeah. You see, so you see, I, I miss corruption, mm -hmm. you know, because <laughs> I want to make America. There's a part where you say, yeah. I want to vote for Trump. Yeah. yeah. Right? Because Trump is the perfect African president. <laughs> Why do you say so? No, because we've seen that before. <laughs> we have seen that. We've, guys, let's be honest. Yeah. <laughs> You've seen a president that just says whatever he wants. Exactly. That's, that's <laughs> it. Right there. That makes so much sense. I would vote for that guy. As I would vote for that guy. <laughs> so, you, you know, Lenmo, um, I have heard stories about, yeah. about your, um, your village, you know? Yes. Finally getting a traffic light. Aragadiwa. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, I wanted to tell, tell me mm. something. Mm. You know, did anyone try to to take um, you know, selfies with it? That traffic light? <laughs> <laughs> of course. Okay, here's the thing. So with comedy, you see what happens is normally what, what we do as, as comedians, we over exaggerate. Yeah. That's where the the jokes come from. Okay. You okay. see, yeah. for example, when they say 
Pai wapo tsuro na gudo. Mm-hmm. Asira kutsuro na gudo. Ai tota ora ga vanga to ripo. Yeah. Oh na it's yeah. just you're painting a picture. Mm-hmm. So it doesn't mean that there's actually traffic like in my village. There's yes. a village like that that like, mm-hmm. That's similar to Chimani Mani. Yeah. That is a traffic light and people mm-hmm. are like, ah, the traffic light. Yeah. Let me tell you a story. When it's Zuari, we saw Chimani Mani, but Andrew Kuchikoro, she can't zip a post office, but you can't zip a post office, but you can't zip a post office. Yes. You can't zip a post office. Serious. You can't zip a post office. 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 You I trust me this guy is going to break my ribs yeah, I don't know <laughs> but anyways it's a, it's a, it's your show it's yeah, your show sure. and uh, you know what um my brother mm. you are you are, you are, you are raising Thank the you. country's flag you know Thank high you. and also well done about um, all that Thank you well done it means a lot you know because when I, when I'm in America I'm not just doing this for myself yeah I'm doing this for my people because When I, whenever I see your mm. whatever thing you, you you say I'm from Zimbabwe yes. you always say that yes. I'm from I, Zimbabwe and I make sure to say that all the time yeah. because I'm not trying to blend in I'm not trying to be an american mm-hmm. that we've seen so many americans yes. it's time you know zimbabwean tells their own story Stories. yeah you know that. Yeah. normally when they talk about zimbabwe in america mm-hmm. it's always something bad bad yes it's always yes. like oh there's you know hunger mm-hmm. or oh, there's this or the the, the economy all age. of that you see you know? so now they're like ah how can this person be this happy yes like he, i'm telling my zimbabwean mm. story and i think that's it's time yeah you know and yeah. i'm happy I'm, i'm you know i'm i'm doing that yes. so i'll always have that zimbabwean Great. identity because there's another learn more yeah somewhere yeah very true and i'm representing that other learn more yeah. next time mm-hmm. they're going to go on another big stage yeah. and do the same thing yeah. see what i mean so yeah well done man yeah and you performed at the shoko festival recently how was yes. it how was it Okay, I'll tell you this from listen, starting from uh when I was back in 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 in, in America. Yeah. I was skeptical yeah. to come back to Zimbabwe. Why? You know, my comments going to go to ah, don't you come around. I don't know penga yo. Uno pio no no penga yo. I got ah, that's and rip my one in there. But airport there don't guys. Not better boy, not better boy, but what? But I'll tell you this, just yeah. the love. Mhm. From my people soga yes. i am so motivated uh-huh. people are like ah, thank you for representing us mm-hmm. that that's why i do yeah. what i do yeah well yeah. that's you know it's just so beautiful I, mm-hmm. i'm so grateful for that love so on the choco festival mm-hmm. people showed up so, so you know beautiful. the reception was good it was just beautiful yeah yes i i had so much fun the, the show was held in chitungwiza you know on wakafaras uh, no, no this show so there's two venues mm-hmm. So the show that I did was in uh, Garare Gardens. Okay. Yeah. The other one was in Chita. We're taking it to the ghetto. Oh. Which to is an entertainment fara man. I I see. Exactly, guys. That's that's yeah, great. Right. <laughs> so, are there any, you know, recommendations uh, for the organizers, mm. you know, going forward? Yeah, from what, you, what from what you've seen mm. so far, uh, but Shoko. Yes. Let's listen. What I first of all what I like this year for Shoko is it's a Zimbabwean lineup. Mm-hmm. The headliners have a Zimbabwean, you know, in them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like Nadia Nakai, you know, and Lenmo Jonasi, yeah. you know, it's yeah. everybody Zimbabwean. Mm-hmm. They didn't get, you know, artists from, you know, and I and, and I love that. Yeah. That's I, I've always wanted to see mm-hmm. something like that. Yeah. And I also held a workshop by Shoko Festival for, okay. for Zimbabwean comedians. Nice. Just to share the tools that I've learned from my journey. Mm-hmm. And it's so nice to give back to my community because This is what made me um, Zimbabwe, Zimbabwe yeah. made me mm. so I have to give back yeah, on yeah. so I'm glad we had a meeting we talked about it so I think they're on the right track mm-hmm. honestly yeah. they, like it's in, in it's in good hands yeah. Choco festival uh, next year so I get bigger and bigger exactly. I, have, I have a feeling great yes so that was the background you know mm-hmm. of the recent events yes now born a little more <laughs> ma nyenyeka ma nyenyeka ma nyenyeka yeah, yeah. back in 1993 you know mm-hmm. you were Kuchipinge huko. Mm. <laughs> you're not that old, you know. Kumore budget. Kumore budget. What do you mean? <laughs> so you're not that old. What are you saying? <laughs> no, but it's okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Briefly tell us about your, yourself. Kutoro wangangu za kuzeti who really, you know. Me. Yeah. yeah. So in any I was raised by my grandparents, Kuchman Mano. Mhm. Waka ndi wandi raised zangu. Yeah. Because I'll tell you this, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be very vulnerable with this. Yeah. Uh, when I was when, I, when my mother was pregnant with me mm-hmm. uh, my father didn't want anything to do with me wow in mtare you yeah. know they, you know my grandmother and my grandfather actually mm-hmm. went to them and uh, they said no they were actually laughing mm-hmm. to my grandparents faces like ah oh. no we're not gonna we don't even want anything oh. about that yeah. you know yeah but then uh, my grandfather was like I'll 
take care mm-hmm. of this mzukuru wangu yes. yes. mana wangu yeah. i'll bring him in and anojika anojika anora pa norara and i respect him for that yeah. and yeah. i'm grateful because i'll tell you this if i was not raised by my grandfather mm-hmm. i wouldn't be a comedian today yeah everything is you know it happens for a reason hey. so he raised me in chimani mani mm-hmm. oh, he was working at a forest commission a foresting company yeah. you know we we had i had a great life mm-hmm. i discovered comedy because of you know my grandfather yeah. I, ona, my, my comedy ona. oh yeah i want easy. i want to give people an opportunity to laugh yeah. the same way you know they're doing for my grandfather yes. so yeah. i started mimicking that yeah you know oh, and my grandfather the thing is he's a nice guy mm. he, he supports me he, you know the first time i told him that a comedy did you anam dude and thank god pedza chikoro wa pedza then you when did ngoya kwa ndir i'll give i'll help you wow so that it was always in my head to man man in high school i was i remember the first day i was like i know that comedy that for a mess jiko bula exam leso ngati ah mess ndazithaza kanti mess yangeri english <laughs> because english i can't say it's <laughs> in english really i got of foil am dara because in iowa you get a comment because they don't learn more am dara about foil am it's nigga ah guys i'm so daro learn more failing <laughs> more <laughs> so yeah so yeah i was raised by my grandfather my mm. grandmother you know my grandmother she's a writer mm. she writes books about okay. the girl child yes Uh, Cyclone Idai she wrote a book mm-hmm. about Cyclone Idai she's wow. she's a very uh, strong woman you know mm-hmm. so she inspired yeah. me to be a creative writer too mm-hmm. so, like, so you know a writer as well no joba jokes kunyora ka oku ndikati Yes. 2008 angari mawani ipapo 2008 and everybody's together yes. that's what i want yeah. that's that's a yeah. zimbabwean family right mm-hmm. there mm-hmm. Oh, no. so yeah. i was raised in love mm-hmm. and that's what i want to just spread love oh, no. yeah. to one another mm-hmm. oh, no. so yes my grandfather as soon as i say i want to be a comedian yeah. mari kwira zupko enda ko harare first time tanga zvinhu tanga zvinhu tone munda ka foira ma you shamwari you 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 kwese <laughs> serious <laughs> remember i'm telling you i don't have a degree nothing Jeez. no degree nothing i nyora english chai chai uh-huh. it took me time nyora english yeah you yeah, still have to learn more learn more dai kopa wangu kana chikopa wangu dai zo you just tell ago nyora ndikazi ndakumpa ndikati gogo na is tarangu zvanzi ndiya anonzi owen owen ndiri kana ndo ndo ndi ndo tarangu tarangu kopa hoko kopa sawar dona na to kopa Anyway, yeah, I'm out my one. Close this yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'll tell you this. The yeah. reason why for me is the educational system for me failed me. Yeah. And I'm just going to say it point blank. Yeah. It failed me. There are, there, there are kids like me mm-hmm. with, that learn differently yeah. than everyone. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, we don't learn the same way. Why, why do you say so? So I'll give you, I'll tell you this. For me, I discovered the way I learn. I'm very visual. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm very visual. I reading and I, it's tough for me yeah. you know, i learned how mm-hmm. i learn yeah. so that's how english and utawa right i learned from watching comedy by tv really what is, ah, so, all right all right kunyora mm-hmm. chekcheko mm-hmm. ah comedy kutunyora comedy mm-hmm. came from that yeah. well, it's be, i think it's because kuti pauna in the grade 1 and mm-hmm. go separate oh yeah so the grade 1 mm-hmm. a b c d e e right mm-hmm. uh, d e right yeah. and then in class mom and go separate afoot group 1 2 3 4 5 yes so how do you how, how do you progress you are surrounded by mm. by the same mm. medi- you know you know what i mean yeah. there's no okay, inspiration I get, you, no. i get you even if i wanted to be good mm-hmm. there's no way yeah. you could you're going to be good yeah. so that failed me 
That is very young age. In grade one E. Grade one E, group seven. Imagine. <laughs> Who do you even copy, guys? Josh, Josh, same wrong answer, I can imagine. Yeah. You know, I was having this conversation mm. with my with my uncle some other time. Mm. You know, he was telling me he's in German and he was mm. saying to me, ah, you know what? Mm. In Zimbabwe, I think the education system somehow mm. needs to change. Yes. And I was like, okay, wh- wh- why do you say so? He's like, no, it's we are we are teaching one you know about competition. Yes. Not to progress. Yes. Uh, because when we go to the I number one. Then we go to number three. Number three. Exactly. So one well, feel like number thirty six and something like that. Then you couldn't. You want to write grade one A. You want to grade one E. Yeah, me want E exactly. I want E or red. That's what I mean. I don't go by far, but it's just E. Exactly. Something like that. But even the teachers, the way they treat yes the kids in E. Yeah. It's totally different, totally from, A. different from A. So they were saying it's competition yet. Mm-hmm. As you them one. As you them one. And they were saying in Germany it's mm-hmm. like unongo in dagutchkoro. You go and pass that and afuira unongo zonda. We don't group together. Exactly. Because I'll I'll, I'll tell you this. Unongo zayakutchkoro ni ni. I learned mm-hmm. different lessons. Yeah. How to talk to people. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Socializing. Because chikoro is supposed to, to give you the tools. Yes. To be able to go into the world. Mm-hmm. You know the world is changing. Yes. Every second. So if you learn. Something today, and yeah. tomorrow it's not relevant because very AI. Very true. Very Kwane. true. Yeah. So you need to learn how mm-hmm. to learn, how to adjust yourself. Mm-hmm. Now that's education. Yeah. Financial literacy. Mm-hmm. How do you use money? Mm-hmm. We can put a million dollars now. How are you gonna do? How are you gonna keep it? How are you gonna make yeah. more millions from yeah. that? Makes sense. We don't have that education. Mm-hmm. No. So that's right there. Mm-hmm. That's the problem. So we need to revisit education. So the Minister of Education. Please. <laughs> you know, my points are not for one of them, but it's for exposure. You know, yeah, yeah, that's very true. The guy is from America, yeah. you know, he's telling us uh, <laughs> <laughs> what he learned from America. So, yeah, yeah. Let, me, let me just take you back mm. a little bit. You know, you talked mm. about how you, you were raised, yes, and um, how your father sort of say neglected you, exactly. He said no to me. So, are you in good books now? No, I've never, I've only met him once in passing. Mm-hmm. You know, and I was a baby. I was just a boy. Oh, and, and yeah, I never, I never wanted. Is he, to, is he still alive? I have no idea. Oh, I don't even know. But here's the thing: I never felt like I didn't have a father. Yeah, because my grandfather was there. Mm. The day I felt like something is missing mm-hmm. was when Kuchikora took us in. You know, I don't know your father. about your father. I don't know what I'm talking about. You know, did you? Did you go? You were angry again. As a kid, you're trying to process it. Exactly. How is it's this? difficult. It's so difficult. Yeah, and I'm, I'm sure I'm not the only one. I understand. I can relate. This is yeah. why I'm sharing mm. it because I know there's so many landmores out there with yeah. the same situation. Yeah. But that will never stop you from your mm. destiny. Never. Yeah, true that. That actually will give you blessings. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, 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 I like that. So the same name that you're using right mm-hmm. now is from your Gogo so, side or what? So Jonasi is my grandfather's. Mm-hmm. Because I, he led by example. Okay. I want to be like him. Like him. So mm-hmm. learn more Jonasi. Right. Is it what's on your ID? No, no, no. no. So in I'm learn more Mwanyenyeka. Mm-hmm. That's the you know family name. Yeah. Like but your father's name. My no no no. Your my grandfather, my grandparents' name. Oh, I'm yeah. I'm not even associated. <laughs> oh, you're like, I don't know. I don't know. Exactly. Yeah. I'm I belong to the Mwanyenyekas, yeah. you know, yeah. in <laughs> I was raised by them. So yeah, I, you yeah, know. I understand. But I'll tell you this though, I mm-hmm. I forgave him. Mm-hmm. You I, did. I, that that's that's what you need to do. Yeah. I grew up mm-hmm. at some point I was like. Why am I stressing myself? Yes, yes, yes. I have a life. Very soon I'm going to have kids. Sure. I'm going to be the best father yeah. to those kids. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. Yeah. Now that's 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 what I want. Mm-hmm. You know, so yeah, my grandfather led by example. So that's why I'm going to take that, put it in my life. So that's why I'm Jonas. And I, I like that. Mm. You know, I didn't know that about you. Yeah, that's yeah, that's why so I'm now, here. So <laughs> now how how big is your is your family now? Because uh, mm. you, or maybe should I say you're still on the market? Mm. Uh, I, I saw a screenshot. I am not you shared. on the market. Yeah, like, <laughs> I, I saw a screenshot that you shared. Even I, I, I talked. I, I talked. Is about men, and you responded to that uh, email saying in a court. He said, "Did you agree an American white woman?" Yeah. <laughs> I love American women. 
Um, are you serious? Deliver bots, <laughs> but I'm from Zimbabwe. Exactly. Iyo apu yangu iyo. Unu kumpa number. Akato, akato yaku inbo. Akato tindu down. Tutuwa kwa umu kazi murungu. Serious? Eh, no business rangu manjima, guys. Ekana ah. mchida warungu ka. Come to me. And the business rangu. No gazi rai. And it's like, don't, no one's not black and I say, Mudafu, Mutete, I'll fix the visa. Guess like, isn't, that, isn't that like human trafficking? <laughs> <laughs> you got a reason. No, I had a question now. Yeah, but I'm going to go out to now. 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 In a loving relationship, right? And I'm happy. Is she a Zimbo or she's South African? She's South African. Yes, yes. Why did you choose a South African? I was based in South Africa for six years. Six years, yeah. But see, there are Zimbos in South Africa. Remember? Yo, what, what are you trying no, to no, say? No, no, I'm just asking. You know, no, but we have the same people. No, I understand. This is how you end xenophobia. You make them Zimbabweans. You know what? Jai Luto, that's so. What? Pano, I don't know Zimbabwe. You know what? Zimbabwe. What do you want? I am doing this for you. Okay. I'm not in South Africa. Could you say that? I don't know, but I, at least a dilute. Same question. Exactly. Go, 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 it's okay. Dilute. I will say I'm a Zimbabwean. <laughs> so are you planning on marrying her? Ah, Chimbomira is. Or one in No, but that's how we're going to end this. No, I was Chimbomira is. Right. Because if you mean to go to the room, you can say, "Rora, one of you, you just pin the phone." Oh, so can you just go to the room? No, you guys, we just want to go to the room. Right, right. You see, we're not together. We're planning. We're not. We're going to bed. 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 Yeah. But uh, you know what? Tell us about your your journey in stand-up comedy. Mm. You know, when did you realize this is what you you wanted? to do yeah so like what I said, inspired you so like i said it was after that test yeah the, the english test and yeah I remember, I remember where i was standing mm-hmm. and i was like i want to do this comment yeah so like the guru wakani pamari um 2011 12 yeah one first time big city yeah i've never been in arare something, and I was going to get a cheap because comedy. How do you even? Pana no tora serious. How do you even? Back then, pana is the stand up comment. Yeah, yeah, sure. When we talk about drama, drama. Oh yes, because do what I see. Like a fupi. My drama, yeah, like street theater. Street theater, and I loved street theater too. Yeah. Shout out to Kapupi. Yes. Ah, he paved he paved it away. Yeah. Look at daughter. Exactly. Parafin. Yeah, my dad, my legends, and a gringo. Green. <laughs> and then you tell me there's no comedy in Zimbabwe. Yeah, hey, Baba. <laughs> anyway, kwako ni my legends. So, so wakati pa mare mvadai marare. First time, big city. Yeah. Wana ndrukwa dzana. Eh, pa pa ni ensi book cafe. Yeah. Pa itwa ensi simka comedy every month. Mm-hmm. Yes, I remember. So kanda ga approach a dog vikela. Na Simba the comic. Yeah. Simba, I want to do comedy. No, but mm-hmm. man, man, ah, we took about five minutes. Exactly. Umbo trial. Two hours on eight. Show vada shika ku book cafe makazara van. Iwe. Ugu, hey, I was nervous, Mdara. Mm-hmm. But I was stage, I saw, ah, yeah. I was booed, Mdara. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I was booed, stage within one minute, Mdara. <laughs> That's when I learned with our comedy, I asked my fans. Yeah. Ah, yeah, you were. Hey. Once now, boo. But I boo, boo, Baba stage. Because you are, you, people have paid. So, this is the issue. What's funny, which man, man, mm-hmm. it's not funny, go. But it's a lesson that I learned because the same principle I took it, I moved to South Africa. Yeah. What's funny here? It's not funny in South Africa. South Africa. True that. Yeah. So I learned how to, to communicate. Mm-hmm. With the audience, like to learn their culture yeah. and find ways to tell my yes. story in, yes. in, in in their way. Mm. Oh, no. mm. Oh, no. So um, the guy, you know, I was doing comedy for years. My dad, you know, she never was done. I back book a fair, but if you want to go, when you go, that's a more. I saw it. Do I want to come back? Who was done? I was there doing the groundwork. Yeah. Sometimes we knock my shows. When I saw music, you need comedy. When I'm bawling, I'm going to exactly music. I'm going to the chat. <laughs> exactly. That teach me how to perform to demand people's attention. Yes. Now put me in any room. You can deliver. I would 
You proved that, man. <laughs> you proved that. But not, you. Uh, but not that. Yeah, but you not that. that. Yes. But you used to go by the name Long John. Long John, yes. You know, that's in, true. In your comedic uh, you yes. know, career. Yes. But you reverted to learn more Jonas. You that's know, true. What inspired this change? So Long John, perfect name. Mm -hmm. Perfect name for comedy. It, it was perfect. Mm -hmm. But the reason why I went to America, I went to America, mm -hmm. for like a year and under Long John. I said, anyway, Long John, who, who is Long John? Mm hmm is he a character? Yeah. It doesn't fit with the Zimbabwean narrative. I'm not the only person with a name like Len Moore yeah. in Zimbabwe. Mm -hmm. Len Moore, give more. Yes. Talk more. Exactly. Oh, no. Tell it's more. A, tell more. It's a Zimbabwean story. Yeah, true. And it's, it's instantly unique. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because, ah! Because, mm -hmm. and I'm glad I did that because mm -hmm. as soon as I did that, yeah. people want to hear. Why? Why? Why is your name Len Moore? Len Moore and I'll yes. tell you though, people love that those names because mm -hmm. yeah. they're unique. It, very true. They're not like Josh. What is a Josh? <laughs> is it a sound effect? Guys, <laughs> I, I like Josh. Josh. Dude, they, what, what is a Zek? 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 What is a Zek? <laughs> learn more. You know exactly what it means. You le <laughs> learn more, manangu. Exactly. <laughs> learn more. Exactly. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So that's why I went back to my name. It's, yeah. a, it's a real person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and I'm glad it. I did that. <laughs> yeah. And you said, you know, you grew up in Chimani Mani. Mm. Do you agree that um, where you come from, mm. you know, doesn't uh, determine how far you can go in life? Listen, <laughs> you need to be, you need to, to be able to look back where you come from. Yeah. This is where you get, that's where you get tools mm -hmm. that will help you to where you're going. Okay. Well, yeah. If you neglect home and become the thing that's where you're going, mm -hmm. you forget who you, who you are. Yeah. Identity is very important. So there'll be like an identity crisis. Exactly. Yeah. It's very, culture. Mm -hmm. Zimbabweans, we need to revisit our culture. Mm -hmm. Look at, mm -hmm. uh, talk, let's talk to our, to, our, to our grandparents. Yeah. Let's see how they, they used to do things, our mm -hmm. culture. I think you go far. So yeah. it doesn't, let's look back mm -hmm. at ourselves. That would that'll take you far. Yeah. Definitely. That's very powerful. Yeah. Let me know. Who money, money, you know. Hey, don't don't go. 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 Don't it, you are safe. <laughs> and I'm safe. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I don't go on. In an uh, interview you did, um, mm. you know, with the uh, ear ground, ear ground mm. Africa, you know, you once mentioned mm. uh, you were not uh, academically uh, strong. Yes. In the water, about food, which are I just call it Chinese. Chinese. Yes. But now we've found that we are not so good at it. 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 We because I want to enhance yeah. my comedy. Yeah. Well, I'm yeah. studying creative writing. I'm mm -hmm. uh, very soon. Uh, I'll be attending like a like a, a, like a college in um, in Pittsburgh. Yes. Where film writing. Mm -hmm. well, because I want to enhance my writing in comedy. I see. How and guy don't know that's engineering. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to. I have to use these tools. Well, in so your yes, comedy career. Ex in my comedy career, in my yeah. acting, I want to go do acting movies. Yes. Well, yeah. And I'm gonna study acting. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I'm gonna yeah. learn how the greats used to do it. Mm -hmm. I wanna come back to Zimbabwe, shoot my own movies. Yes, the way like learn to um, from America, come yeah. back home and do it here. Do it here. So I'm doing the groundwork. I'm learning. I see. To America, mm -hmm. So education is important. Is important, but it depends. Mm -hmm. What, like, how are you gonna do it? Like, why are you do, studying that yes. specific pro? You know, yes. you don't just go with a hundred when you go to start that. What? <laughs> do you, first of all, do you, do you love the thing that you're studying? Yes, yes. And are you going to use it? Mm -hmm. 
That's yeah. what I'm doing. That's powerful. Yeah. <laughs> you have taken, uh, you know, a comedy uh, yeah. course in mm. the UK with uh, Laughing Horse. Yes. Do you believe comedy can be taught? And what did you gain, you know, from that Oh, training? my God. So that's, that's very powerful. Yeah. Right there. Because before I even took the course with uh, Laughing Horse, yeah. I took the course with Simuka Comedy. Mm -hmm. That's when I learned the basics of why people laugh at a joke. Mm. What's a, what is a joke? Yeah. That simple question. Mm -hmm. As a comedian, you need to just know it like the back of your hand. Yes. Hold on. What is the joke? So mm -hmm. you need to become a student of comedy. Yeah. You're are, you are studying comedy. You're reading mm -hmm. all the books. Yeah. So being fun is not taught, mm -hmm. but you can you can teach the, the principles mm -hmm. that will enhance the funny. Yeah, I see. Mm -hmm. you can you got born funny listen in ni kuchikoro ka kwako ni wana anga ndo seke sa ufura ini ni mdara ka yeah and i thought yeah but i don't like it so yeah yeah but he says he at ya kwa aiwe abatori abatori no wana exactly wana but if he had the tools mm -hmm. anga dar kumbiri ah iwe achitochi manya achitochi manya mdara yeah kuna no those like we remind me so kuna no nyeso seke sa ka iwe but was not but mun akachitora se kire so don't bother don't bother but now mun yoka misa pa stage it's a different feeling. Yeah. Yeah. Because in the first time by stage, mm -hmm. we are standing Pamberi Pevan, first of all. Yeah. You know people are looking at you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? You're speaking to a mic, you can hear your, yourself. Yes. And then there's a light right here. Mm -hmm. Ah, anyway, you two confuse you. Of what did you change? Do Peter say, my, my joke says how much you are. Well, tell me so. You do you know a sort of varana. And when I know fear with the stage, that's very true. So very it's true. it's an art form. Mm -hmm. So it can be taught, but the fun itself, mm -hmm. it's in you. You just need very to look true. for it. Yeah. Oh, no. You know what? I want mm -hmm. to ask you something. Uh, yes, please. Uh, Papa Lenny. Uh, what kept you going, mm. you know, despite these uh, setbacks in mm. life? Of course, yeah. yeah. Comedy was the only thing that I had. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. Uh, plus, also the issue of that, the father issue. Yeah. First few like years, mm -hmm. it pushed me. Yeah. Because you're like, why am I, why was I rejected? Yes. No, I'm going to show him. Yes. I'm just gonna go out there mm. and be the best comedian in the world. Wow. It saved me, but it's not healthy. Mm -hmm. But as a man, you got to see healthy. healthy, yeah. You pray about it, you're like, you know what? I forgive him. This mm -hmm. is fine. Yeah. I'm I have to, I have to be able to do this thing without this, you know, like this thing behind me. Yes. I do I have to do it because I love it. Mm -hmm. So the now. I perform comedy. You see me laughing at my jokes. Yes. Because I'm I'm actually enjoying. Enjoying, yeah. You see, you can actually watch Tengas, I'm a freeze dusk, I'm a freeze dash. Apanaka. Apanaka. Go one by Tikana, Uka Bigra Sadza, Munacha Bigaga Sajaga, 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 Making people laugh. So I want to scare, but point the good Let me quit. You want to ask? Oh, no, oh, oh, fire is on. Ask The idea will come to you. So there's there's a there's a thing you know called uh, called uh, motivation. Mm -hmm. This has mindset. Mindset. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. Let's say oh, I plan to do maxene ganda go jogga. I want to be healthy. Yeah. What I motivated him, Dara Andika. Well, I think I busted Zago to go jog as yet. Well, for a do, Chalo Chema Chema July Chesh of Jacuti, who first in Pama. Motivation, you know, Bruga, when I went away. But exactly. mindset, man, Jiga, you put in no matter what, mm -hmm. I'm going to do this. Thing. Yeah. Dara, I went to South Africa, I would perform in places where you, like, dangerous, you hear gunshot mm. next door hey. and show, show it to a ticket. Oh. And you are there yeah. making people laugh. Hey. I've been in bus, I've traveled to ku, 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 ku South Africa, Koga, mm -hmm. bus, Kuneta, five minutes set. Hey, Mangwana, Dabuzok. That determination, because yeah. I wanted it yeah. so bad. Till today, mm. I still do the same thing with America. Yeah. Sometimes, Ga, to Kura Bazin. What have you been on the robbers? show. Five minutes, Zangu, Kuka Taunak. Peace begs Zangu, not Zok. Yeah. It's that drive. Yeah. I love this mm -hmm. thing so much mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that not, nothing would take it away yes. from me. Yes, I, I like that. You know, yes. In, in 2016, Lenmo, mm. you know, you opened for, for Barry Hilton. Yes. You know, how did you connect with him? Oh, and uh, what did you learn from that experience? Barry Hilton became family. 
Oh my God. So there's uh, there's a promoter that used to book comedy that invited Anika Nsime yes, to come to, yeah. to Zimbabwe twice. Yeah. And he also booked uh, different comedians, like mm -hmm. big comedians from South Africa. Yeah. This particular year, he booked Barry Hilton. And then he's like, are you, I see your stuff. Yeah. You should open for Barry Hilton. Because mm. he knew that I wanted to be global. So he, Barry Hilton is very global. Yeah. yeah. So I, that promoter helped me. Mm -hmm. So but I want to open up Barry Hilton. I can do another so that I'm fun. Mm -hmm. South Africa, dudes. Yeah. I can't vura my doors. Mm. He taught me sim simplest of things in comedy that I still use today. Yeah. Oh, and I, mm -hmm. Like he's been doing comedy for 40 years. He's like, anyway, experienced. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I, my, my Parker's comedy club, my, my, my comedy club in, in South Africa, mm -hmm. I, doors opened because of him. Yeah. I did TV with Comedy Central. Mm -hmm. because it's because of Barry Hilton. Wow. You know, the doors really opened. Mm -hmm. I've always been blessed to have the right people behind me yeah well, like you ola mm -hmm. i came here you, you are the right person for this <laughs> i had to Thank come you. here and tell yeah. you my story yeah. you see so exactly. yes yeah it's, I, it's I, blessings I, but and you know <laughs> I, I want to know something mm. how do you gauge your your audience's reaction during a live show because mm. and also how do you handle situations when jokes you know don't land mm. expected because <laughs> 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 It's experience. You same same here. Yo. Yeah, yeah. Yes, true. You find a way to yes. make the interview interesting. Yeah, yeah true. And it, mm -hmm. experience. I've been doing it for years. Mm -hmm. I now know how I handle myself in different situations. Very true. I have jokes in an arsenal back there. Yeah. So if this person says something, mm -hmm. I have something to say. Mm -hmm. I always have something to say. Well, yeah. So it's all about experience, you know, um, and I love when I go off script. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> it's part of me. Because my, 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 my audience, mm -hmm. you know, I got to see mm -hmm. them, I got to see them, I got to see them, I got to see them, I reception wise, mm -hmm. I got to see them, I got to see them, I got to see them, I got to see them. So, you know, that is it about language barrier or what? It's more than language, it's, yes, language barrier, but it's more than that, it's also culture. Right? Yeah, and also, what people consume, mm -hmm. uh, you see, okay, I'll give an example. It's a perfect example. Yeah. The guy, like, Bonandri ku South Africa, and you would perform ku Cape Town. Yeah. Cape Town is different. Mm -hmm. It's more tourists from oh, different places. Yeah, and, places and, yeah. and then in Cape Town, you're more mm -hmm. much like, Black, black yeah. people. Yeah. They, they laugh at different things. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. So as a comedian, it's your job to find out the, their culture, mm -hmm. learn their culture. So you have to do like your, your research, your way, research. Way, way, way before you perform. Oh, yeah. Listen, in Nenka, I go town, like a different town, I go there day early. Okay. And I will talk to anyone I find there. Yes. But I go to Zimbabwe because uh -huh. I'm so out of touch. <laughs> yes, on. yeah. I got up beside him in Zimbabwe and so I was talking to him. Yeah. Because he's what's happening? Yeah. Did you go exactly. to a conversation? Yeah. But airport, we are talking. Yeah. That's where you get the insight. Mm. You're learning what's happening, mm. Chichi. Yeah. That's how you do your job as a comedian. Mm -hmm. So that's... But, that, but it must be difficult, it's, man. It's so much work. Yeah. So much work. I can tell. I can stage tell. And that's the bonus. I want to pay this. I want to pay this. But I want to pay this. 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 I see you for this or for this no, jokes. No, it change the script. No, so sometimes this audience, I see you for this for this type of delivery. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You say, okay, how can I get them to my side? Yeah. First, talk about you or them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, let's talk about this. So when I get up America's good talent, mm -hmm. many people are saying, ah, we don't know what you're talking about. Exactly. Say, how do you piece that out? Uh -huh. But... They don't understand comedy is very psychological. Right. And it is. Mm -hmm. You have to be able to make fun of yourself. Right. To make fun of them. Oh, yeah. I'm going to say, ah, TV is going to be Exactly. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, ah, TV is going to be like, I'm going to say, 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 Exactly. You put yourself down. Yeah. Also, GG. Remember, I said, I talked about Chimani Man, Andiga. Yes. What was my next joke? Mm -hmm. Poor white people in, in, in exactly in, they were laughing. Yeah, now they can relate because it's close I, to home. Exactly, now. I've just put myself here. Yeah. Now they're like, ah, 
Then I'm going to send you I'm going to white people. I'm going to send you a white people. I'm going to send you a white people. So it's it's very psychological. Yeah. Oh, you in the next performances after the you know that mm -hmm. one I was going deep on the yeah. racism in media because mm -hmm. yeah. I always talk about how America is not the best country in mm -hmm. the world. Yeah. I'll say this point blank. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's just the branding. I just hope they you're going to lose your green card. I, no, no, no. The, <laughs> America knows. No, I tell them into their faces. Yeah. It's just it's just the branding. Mm -hmm. I think Zimbabwe is going to do the same thing. Yes. Let's rebrand some words. Yeah. Anti. Because America, my guess are not in there. Serious? But we're not at rolling blackouts. Instead of saying to my guests, let's say uh, voltage breaks. <laughs> Good for your mental health. On. Anyway, yeah. the government wants you to exactly. them, you know, break. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, a break. It's, a, it's a man, it's, it's mental health. Wow. See, so it's, it's all about branding. Yeah. The guy told me that I'm America. Who am I saying? Oh, I'm saying America. Oh, oh. I'm talking about which man? Man, here. Who told you where is Sundara? Anyway, who never rung you when we were? Ah, can I bring you some America? Ah, nigga, guy. Who does that? Nigga, who does that? Rung you? Ah, because you know, 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 you there are people that stay or so. Ah. Family of eight people hey. living in a one trailer park. There's also ah. hunger in America. Ah. It's just ah. it's just that what they show you mm -hmm. is, is they're just marketing. Oh, no. they're yeah, just saying, oh, it's branding. Good, good, good brand, brand. No, yeah. oh, no. That's just how it is. It's yeah. That's all it is. Every so, country so, has so its why, problems. So why are you aid? Zimbabwe yet to America in need? I think it's a friend. <laughs> it's, a it's a front. They're just <laughs> no. There is there is actually hunger there. That side. That side. It's actually for real. Like I'm not even joking. That uh, there's problems there. I didn't know. No, I'm telling you. There's not not just hunger. Yeah. But I was talking about safety. Like mm -hmm. the food. The food. Gun violence. Gun violence. People are dying. Mm. See, it's it's not like it's not even funny anymore. Yeah. Like it's really really yeah. bad. Yeah. On. So then you're like, yeah, so so why why would I raise my raise mm -hmm. my kids? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want them to have the freedom I have with my money. Yes. Wanna. Not here. No, not here. Here I'm I'm here to learn, you know, get my you know, and, and, and also, you know, take back mm -hmm. what I've learned, which money money. Yeah. But tell you the so, so, so you, it's like, like your, your plan is like not to stay in America no, for, no, no, forever. No, 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 no. I want to be a global mm -hmm. comedian. Yeah. You know, America, America. America is global. Yeah. We, every, the whole world watches American, American yeah. media. Mm -hmm. So you go there. You do America's Got Talent. Mm. The world sees you. Yes. Then you have a chance to go to Australia, yeah. UK. Or you've become global. Yes. But you're telling your Zimbabwean story. Story. Or a man. Yes. It becomes easy for another landmore to go on a global stage because... Mm -hmm. That Zimbabwean story is there. People are now more yes. interested in yeah. that Zimbabwean story. I like that. Yeah. In 2019, you mm. won the Steve Harvey Stand Up uh, Spotlight, yes. uh, People's Choice Award. Mm. How did you, uh, how did that experience you know, impact oh your, your, your career? First of all, Steve Harvey is a mentor now. The, oh, uh, he's oh. a mentor. Ah, uh, anyway, listen, Steve, Steve and me, I'm, I'm, I call him Steve O. Serious? Steve O. I don't have to learn so. I don't nickname him. I don't have to learn so. Steve, Steve O. No, Penga, yo. I don't think that's Steve Do <laughs> you guys talk? No, yeah. So sometimes here and there, it's mm -hmm. a busy man. Yeah. Uh, but I usually talk to his team more. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because he's got a huge team. Oh. So, anyway, I'm blessed. I have people like Steve Harvey. Yeah. His mentors. Now, Terry Crews. Yeah. There's a guy named Gabriel Iglesias. Okay. He's a big comedian who America. America. Exactly. And then I just have different mentors because in life, you need mentors. Mentors, yeah, true. No one is going to do everything. You, you can never get your success mm -hmm. by yourself, man. Mm -hmm. True. There's always people that will help you. Mm -hmm. on a man. Yeah. So yeah, I, I have mentors. I, I that Steve Harvey thing is a competition that I was online. Yeah. And I and I hunt for opportunities. Mm -hmm. Me with opportunities. Yeah. I will hunt for it. You go for it. I don't wait for it. In, how how was that one? So this one, I in the, I'm just scrolling by internet. Like, ah, Steve, I have any competition. I heard that we But online. Ah, that will submit. Exactly. Submit my, my videos. Notification. You've been qualified to the competition. Wow. Whoa. 
compete into the competition. Hey. Boom, won. Steve, I want to see you. Hey. I want, I'm in South Africa right now. Where are you? Dream South Africa. We are tomorrow oh, yeah. at my studio. We're going to shoot our family feud. Let's spend a day together. Jeez. Went there, met his family. We, you know, it was nice. It was a really nice, you know, yeah. meetup. I told yeah. him my dream. Yeah, yeah. The, the, you know, listen, the green card I got, mm-hmm. he had, you know, his hand in that too. Oh. Like he wrote a letter for, as evidence that I'm, I am doing wow. comedy. He's like, this, I vouch for him. Hey. And I, I actually framed it and put Hello, it in. As you are narrating this story, yeah. man, I can see, you know, grace. Yes. You are a blessed man. God, God has been like, to be surrounded you know, with those, you know, the giants in the in the industry. It's cra- I pinch myself. Huh? Yeah, dream room. Yeah. You know, I'm, uh, yeah. Never never. Never never. jokes, Yeah, but that's it, it means you know even <laughs> comedy. It's not just something chatotola lightly. It's it's actually yeah. Because I've seen be. that in I've noticed in America they mm. it, it's something that they take seriously. Exactly. So and they invest in exactly. it. Exactly. That's that's how, what I said about making comedy a culture, mm-hmm. like making it a thing that people should go to. People should like it should be a choice. Uh-huh. Should we go and watch um, and listen to music? Yes. Or let's just go and watch comedy mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. right there. That's where you make the industry, yeah. you know, strong. That's where you make the money for the young comedians, you know. That. That's it. Yeah. That's how they get sustainable. Mm-hmm. And then you end up having comedy clubs. A bar, and it's a comedy yes. chat. Yes. Yeah. And I start the touring. Yeah. I start to show him mom. Um, when they uko, we start exchange one. Okay. Because to create a chi a crowd. A crowd, yeah. In far, in far comedy, it becomes a culture. Because it's news. One more nuga. I told you in news. Mm-hmm. When I go comedy show, do you want to play any music? Right. But it is actually something I don't mm. know. It's a comedy. Yeah. But comedy is like you're attacking this, you're attack, attacking mm. that. You know, in a, mm. in a in a in a funny way. Mm. You know, attacking the government, attacking whatever, mm. even whatever the, my countries, my presidents. Yes. Yes. You know, in a funny way. Zoom zoom. I'm some. I'm also about something. I need challenge. Sometimes the backlash from mm. you know the government and also threats. Of course, you know. So it's. It's just the nature of stand-up comedy. You see, stand-up comedy, it's the idea is you as a comedian, you find the line, you look for the line, yeah, and you challenge it. Mm-hmm. That's comedy. Okay. It's it's not just good to to my jokes, No, it has to to have you know substance. Yeah. At the end of the day, what are you saying? Mm-hmm. What what is the message? Yeah. Well, because I because I saw your, your, your recent clip yeah. at the Sugar Festival where yeah. you were saying, oh. The last, the only thing that I've seen, you know, Chinja, it's like the, 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 the airport road because of Sadak. Yeah, you know, like, like yeah. uh, then there was a line where you say, I hope they're not going to arrest oh me. You know? They was like, I hope they... Yeah. Yes. So were you like, okay, feeling it, oh, I might get the arrest no, no, yes, here. No, no, I was watching the audience. I was like, okay, okay. <laughs> I see what's happening. All right. I'll, I'll just, I'll just say it and move on. <laughs> you know? <laughs> was, the, was the audience ready for that? No. They were not. Not. That, that's why I, I, I actually changed the topic. Yeah. Because it's my job to, to be present in the room. Yeah. I'm not just reciting. Uh-huh. I'm communicating. Yeah. So I'll say something just to test the waters and see. Mm. Oh, you are not ready. Let me find another way to so say you have to this. Quickly change. You have to quickly change. So my next joke after I don't know if you saw it. My mm-hmm. next joke after that was about how like third world. I yeah. say in when you watch the news in America, they always mm-hmm. say a third world country yes. in Africa, Zimbabwe, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. I'm like, when was this race yeah. that they ran by The first themselves? one, the second one. Yeah. Then and, the then, third. and then if if there was a race and America <laughs> was in first place, yeah. clearly the Kenyans were not running in Exactly, yeah. Because we know the Kenyans run, right? <laughs> and they were telling me, they were, ah, you're lying to me. <laughs> and then I go on to say, I'm going to say that every country has things that they are first world, first world at yeah. and third world at. Yeah. In America, they have third world things. Yeah. And let's not lie, they mm-hmm. have, their economy yeah. is first world. Blooming. Yeah. In Zimbabwe, the efficiency of it, our corruption yeah. Yeah, is first world. First bro. world. Ah, bruh. <laughs> bruh, listen. I am not saying that there's no corruption in America. <laughs> in America. It's there, but you have to be making a certain type of money for okay. you to afford corruption. Okay. In Zimbabwe, everyone is corrupt. <laughs> Even you, you're corrupt. My grandmother is corrupt. <laughs> My grandmother bribes God. <laughs> that, that's corruption. Tides. 
That's it's corruption. Bri- oh, it's bribing God. Oh, it's bribing God. So you don't believe in tithe? No, I believe in tithe. Of course, I believe in tithe. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, I'm married. The blessing on any golden buzzer. Exactly. Yeah, guy, I don't bribe, bro. 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 So it's corruption. It's corruption. I like that. And guy. I miss it. <laughs> I like the humor. I like the humor. You know, and, you know, talking about Nyadza, the mm. Steve Harvey, mm-hmm. You know, um, it is one of the, I mean, he's one of the most respected names yes. in, in, in comedy. Mm. What did you take away from your personal interaction with him? Like you said, he's yes. mentoring you now. Yes, uh, Steve Harvey is a businessman. Business. Mm-hmm. All those things that you see him doing, like uh, the uh, beauty pageant, mm-hmm. Miss Universe, and uh, Family Feud, all of those, he owns part of him. Yeah. Honor. Hey. All of them, he owns them. He's yeah. into agriculture. Mm-hmm. He's like a cl- clothing line. Wow. Cigarettes, whatever you know, those cigarettes yeah. that he does. He, I'm sure, he's got you know, like a brand. Yeah, he's a businessman. He knows money. he knows how to use like how to use his 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 art mm-hmm. as a comedian mm-hmm. to to make business around him. Yeah. Comedy is not just making people laugh. Mm-hmm. There's things around it. Yeah, there's things that you can do around comedy. Mm-hmm. This is one of my plans. Uh, very soon, actually, I want to be able to you know to come back to Chimani Money. And build my own Hollywood there. Mm-hmm. Honor. Yeah. Train the, the the local people, filmmaking, mm-hmm. sound engineering, yeah. writing, all of that. Right? Yeah. The influence I have back there, because mm. Hollywood now, people are moving out of Hollywood. Oh, yes. People are looking for somewhere else now. Mm-hmm. You see, now yeah. there's Tyler Perry Studios. Mm-hmm. Honor. Now there's other countries. Yeah. I want to, I want Chimani Mani to be the haven of art. Wow. Because it used to be my own arts festival. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I want that to be home mm-hmm, mm-hmm. where an artist will come to demand money. That's a, that's a big vision. I like that. That's that now. That's mm, the vision. Yeah. Well, I'm I'm actually saying it into existence. Mm-hmm. I want it to go out there. Yeah. Because that's the plan. I'm my plans are for mm-hmm. Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. I'm not, I, what you see me doing in America? I'm yeah doing pushing. it for Zimbabwe. I'm doing it for this country yeah. here. This yeah. is where I belong. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. And you know that mm. same year, uh, mm. Steve Harvey. You know you won the Nama Awards mm-hmm. and also the Savannah Pan African mm. Comic of the Year mm. Award. Um, how did this recognition shape your career? Oh my God! So the Nama, first of all, mm-hmm. it was it was such a nice recognition because I grew up watching the Namas. The Namas. Bazin, 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 yes. Bazin. <laughs> <laughs> and I like my chest so much too. Exactly. One day, I won that award. It was such a nice, Oparago. exactly. It was nice, mm. a nice fist bump. With, ah, Dara. Yes, He's doing the thing. Great. Winning the Savannah Pan African Comedian of the Year. Mm-hmm. This is the biggest comedy award in Africa, by the yeah. way. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Basket Mouth won it last, uh, the last ones, and then it was me. I was I was nominated with Anikan Sime, mm-hmm. Basket Mouth, Africa Inga, Nungwe, and the Chinglish from Zambia. Yeah. And I won it. Mm. It was a nice little, you know, fist bump again. Africa, boom, um, they're doing a thing. Yes. So I I performed all over, like Kenya, Rwanda, mm. Uganda. Yeah. I've performed in all those city, you know, countries and I've mm-hmm. seen, I've learned the culture. Yeah. It was time for me to go to America and represent that. So And I want it, to understand, you mm, know, from mm, Uchiri mm, Baba Guti, mm, you know, what performer all in all these countries, mm, how have these countries, you know, um these different experiences mm, influenced your your comedy? Yes, yes, that's a very good question. Yeah. So I'll tell you this. I wasn't going to be able to represent Africa mm-hmm. without going to these countries. Yeah? Yes, never. What I've noticed is Africans themselves are very ignorant about Africa. Okay. It's out of this world. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. The things that we say about each other. Mm-hmm. You know, <laughs> True that. Go to Somalia. <laughs> just go <laughs> go there it's different <laughs> different in the, I was booked to a show in Rwanda yeah I watched the hotel Rwanda yeah Rwanda Rwanda is the most beautiful countries I've ever been in wow I've never seen anything like that plastic bags are illegal mm. I almost got arrested first I, I got full up big like, what is this the plastic, the plastic big name boots down was exactly. You think you are going to smuggle this in my country? Oh, it's a, just a plastic bag. Then I need my drugs in plastic bag. You know, I just swing it a plastic bag. Not my drugs. <laughs> Not my drugs. My drugs. I don't worry. Plastic bag. Don't worry. But you see, 
<laughs> that is being able to see how beautiful Africa is and uh -huh. learning the culture. The, I went to see the Maasai culture. Yeah. You know, the you know, Tanzania, mm -hmm. I was there, Kenya. You yes. know, I went there. Mm -hmm. I saw my people. I, I could perform for my people. They were yes. loving it. Yes. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. it was easy for me to go to America and represent Africa mm. because I knew who I was representing for, like Zimbabwe and as of Africa. Africa. Oh, no. We are similar, by the way. Yeah, true. Ah, we are the same we people. Are the same people. Ah, we are the same people. Oh, the exactly. Exactly. Nairobi is just like Harare and Dara. Serious? But Andrew, what Exactly. But I, I think we are just Africa. My Africa is 311. 311. We need yeah. to just be united, man. That, that's very true. <laughs> you know, of all the, I mean, your, your performances mm. across different countries, mm. which one stands out the most and why? Oh, my God. Um, so in terms of what? Because there's a lot yeah. for me. So in terms of industry, comedy-wise, mm -hmm. it was K Kenya mm -hmm. because the unity in comedians. Yeah. I had never seen anything like that. Okay. <gasps> mm. When I arrived for this for this um festival, mm -hmm. instead of booking comedians separate hotel room, exactly like the big comedian gets mm -hmm. the nicer room. No, mm -hmm. they book a house, right? And everybody is in that house. house. It doesn't matter how big you are. Okay. You're you, there with you, you, your you're bedroom there. there. Mouth over there. You're there with oh. big comedians. You're there with Anakan Smith over yes. there. Yes. And you're you are you're playing games, you are Together. You're, you're cooking for each other. I was like, ah, just that interaction. I love this. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. And everybody's together. Mm -hmm. And comedy works when you're together with people yeah. that you laugh with. Yeah. And just it just, just made it made it better. Yeah. And I would, when I went to Rwanda, it mm -hmm. was the best country because I got to see the possibilities and the turnaround. Because you know, they are the history of, mm -hmm. of Rwanda. Yeah. And the turn around the head like that. Yeah. That's the possibility. Mm. Yeah. And then you have your Uganda. Uganda? Yeah. Uganda, why are you there? Why? Ah! Tell me about that. We're going to show you TV, so. Mm -hmm. Africa, it could be. <laughs> yeah, it could be TV. Yeah, and I don't know. It's a different Africa. It could be Uganda. Don't go ahead. There are five people on a motorbike. Five? Five. Five. And then number four. Ah! Three from there, I come there like like like. Try so, my bamboo like. Do it, my bamboo. My bamboo. Just leave it like that. Exactly. And that's sorry, potos. There are my potos. I sorry, I have potos. And we don't have that here in Zimbabwe. Yeah, no. Kuna kuti nemi shiga shiga bati. Shiga bati. Bati 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 bati. <laughs> no, but 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 is it like the transport uh, you know problem in Uganda? No, you know, it's, just, like, it's just like the that. culture. Look, I, I I had to experience that. It's just the, you know how they do it. They call it a border border. Okay. So yeah, oh no, border border is like a part of the culture. Oh yeah. Oh, nobody I saw cars on a motorbike. More than cars, nobody I saw. Yeah. I'm gonna go to a motorbike. Go to Kira. I saw. I'm scanning talk about the mm. America God Talent Show. Yes. You know, why did you decide to enter the competition? Okay, so initially I was supposed to enter it last year. Yeah. Oh, last year, not this year. Not this year. Okay. Yes. What happened last year? So I didn't have my green card yet. You know, you cannot perform without a work, work authorization oh. in America. Yeah. You have to have a work authorization. So I've always wanted to do America's Got Talent. Yeah. But I was not ready. Because mm. it's a risk. Yeah. That show is a risk. If you go there when you're not ready, mm -hmm. I too, they will sure, eat sure, you I'll alive. Yes. Yeah. Because there's so much that goes into it. Mm -hmm. It's not just uh, you just go on stage yeah. and you just do your thing. No, you have to you have to to write down your set mm -hmm. word by word. Hey. Pre pre send it to, to the legal team of NBC. Yo. Legal team will send it to the executives. All of those people are gonna come back with notes. Saying no, 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 don't do this, don't do this, and they leave you with a with a chunk like this. Oh, and you're like, how am I gonna work with this? Okay, that's how it's done. Yeah, because it's TV. Yeah, TV is strict. There's no free, it's no freedom. 
because you it's a family show it's yeah. it's, t- it's tv it's, a, it's worse it's america tv yeah Bona. so it was word for, re- word. word for word so i was not ready Bona. so last year i couldn't do it mm-hmm. so uh, this year man in january mm-hmm. cuz i just had my green card yeah boy oh, i had my green card exactly now i can go and perform yeah no and then I, they messaged me randomly mm-hmm. They're like ah let me just uh, we love your story we mm-hmm. love your comedy any chance you get your green card and yes tornado exactly friends ah bo good we're setting up a schedule for you you're coming to audition to actually do the audition audition yeah and uh, like fun of the judges please come through send us your set but send them a set we try to figure out what mm-hmm. works what they want for introduction yeah. Yeah. that's why i had to talk about chimani money oh yeah do you know how many people come to me saying they want to go to chimani money now mm. uh so it's now like a tourist attraction yes People want, oh my God, Terry Crews was like, mm. why don't you come to Shimani Mani? Shimani man? Mani, yeah. You know, because yeah. I've spoken it, they're mm-hmm. like, this person that is this happy yeah. comes from Shimani Mani. Shimani and I had the best childhood growing yes. up. Yes. They want to experience that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Honor, mind you. Yeah. So I was ready to tell my story. And I had I had studied the American culture. Mm-hmm. I knew how to communicate with them. Yeah. So it just worked better. But it's tough. So since you said... Mm-hmm. You do your thing word for word, mm. and they will just remove some mm-hmm. stuff. Yes. You know, then they will leave you with the, the chunk. Now you have to figure out how to. So, in in your case, mm. when you 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 went mm. now mm. in 2024, mm. what are, what are visas? Yes, a lot. Mm. So, oh. prepare. I have punchlines with Angwangaska I had prepared. I had prepared jokes about. Uh, there's a joke about. Um, the Lion King that I wanted to do, mm-hmm. so I did part of it, and they yeah, and they were like, so that one I was licensing. Okay, I couldn't do it because mm-hmm. of license. And then, and then uh, there's another one about that third world. Yeah, when that, the, what I just said about third, third world, world here, yeah, yeah, about the Kenyans. Mm-hmm. No, they refused. They said, nah, not that one. Mm-hmm. There's so many jokes that I wanted to do, that I, I couldn't do because the, 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 you know it's a, they have people mm. working, you know, the, like. The, teams different yeah, teams yeah. you know story team and stuff like, stuff like mm-hmm. that so it's a working machine yeah, yeah so you you really have to be easy to work with mm. so that you also get other p- opportunities you know with them that's re- good reputation yes on so i would work with what i had mm-hmm. i'll be like oh okay you want me to just build up from this from this yeah all right let me go to a to, to a comedy club let's yes. try and see what's funny do this exactly. I do that i do that mm-hmm. until i got the chunk yes and i perform it mm-hmm. By the way, this is tough to perform comedy competing with people that do contusionists, magicians, mm. musicians. Oh, yes, yes. Because yes. these people, mus- musician is just doing a cover Simple. and they have a band playing. playing. They have all this stuff. And they got, yeah. Contusionist is doing things with their body. There's music. Yes. It's a spectacle. Yeah. Where you only have jokes and it's a new thing every week. Hey, hey. And Tough. You, don't, you don't know how they're going to receive it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's a brutal game. It's yeah. a brutal show yeah. for comedians. Yeah. Brutal. So before, before you performed, mm. you know, what was going through your mind mm. uh, and heart? Why didn't you say that time before you performed? Bandu, Bandu backstage before I actually go on. Yeah. I was nervous, man. This can be the beginning or the end of my career. Hey. Right there. Because... Millions of people, people are watching. Like, mm. And Lenmo Genesis is going to be associated with And you know your village guy. people, your village people is what? Mm. Yo, my village people, I'm going to, uh, you know who's the old guy? Hey, exactly. Uh, I'm uh, going to disable. I'm going to disable. And it's <laughs> gone. All that was going through my head. Yeah. So the confidence that you saw mm-hmm. was more of a, you know what? Yeah. Let me do it. I'm just going to go there and just leave everything on that stage. Yeah. 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 Gone. And I, Terry Cruz saw it. Yeah. He saw it. He's like, "All right, I'm going to give you something." <laughs> exactly. Ah, bad press a buzzer. Ready, I'm done. Bam! Ah, we for, saw that. That was enough for me. I was like, "That's because that's what you need. That's what yeah. you want." Yeah. yeah. That that alone will open buzzer. doors. Yes. Mm. I was ready to go home to my quarterfinals. Which is okay, but that and, hey, buzzer, I was already okay. I was already packing my bags. Ah, boy. Okay. Ah, that open. That open. It's okay. Yeah, okay. Semi finals. Ah, ah, all right. Let me. Work on other stuff. Yeah. And create a new material. Perform it. And like, ah, I'm ready to go home. Okay? Picking my bags exactly. again. Exactly. I got the finals. Finals. I'm perform again. Ah, okay, <laughs> Top five. Ah, guys. 
Shamari. It's just Shamari. crazy. Shamari. <laughs> but but you know what? Eh, for God pinned. Mm. Now go to the family in picture picture. For God pinned for the first time now. Wa pinned baby go na mazwa na kawanda ya. Yes. You know. You pinned you know na kawanda. What what was the first thing? Chaka ya brain mago. Ipapo. It's a lot of things, Aniga. Mm-hmm. It's one of one of them is is kind of like oh, I hope they like me. Mm. I hope cuz that's what you, you need you need to be liked as a yeah. comedian. That's yeah, the thing true. first of all. Mm-hmm. I hope they like me and I hope they understand me. Mm-hmm. I come from a totally different you know like communication. Yeah. I'm like I hope they understand me. Mm. And and I'm just like Simon. Simon and Diana Nezo. Exactly. And ah Simon. <laughs> Guys, he's going to go like wah. I'm Daraga and and my one hours I was afraid and so the first hi. Mm-hmm. How are you? Yeah. When I say that, mm-hmm. everything is history. I was just like I belong here. Yeah. Because I treated it like just just any other show. Oh yes. I've done I've been in front of people thousands of times. Yeah, true. Thousands of times. Kwa sababu ndio na kwa kwa na South Africa kwa sababu. One 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 we say thousands of times. Exactly. Chipe fomela bawa na aska zindu kuja comedy. Yeah. Now what's different? Mm-hmm. I just treated it like a show. Yeah. Kwa kati all right. Mm-hmm. Three minutes will change your life. Do your thing. Hey. Let me show you what I do. Ah, na kwa watu. Exactly. Na shimanya aka na kizgo na kati. Yes. Kama na pa shimani mani zwake. And wari kuda kuya kushimani mani when we say. Taka wa mirira. Ah, iwe. Tupa ma shuttle from the airport. Shimani mani straight. Tupa pa minda. Tupa minda. Ione munde. Iwe. Taka na munda munda. Ndoto ndo munda ni. So you have cited uh, you know mm. Ted Cruz uh, mm. as one of your biggest uh, inspirations. Yes. This is um uh, this was your post in a mm. court. You said I am incredibly honored mm. and thrilled to mm. receive the golden buzzer mm. from Terry Cruz. Mm. Um Terry Cruz has always been a mm. role model yes. for me mm. and this moment is a dream come true. Yes. I hope to make Zimbabwe proud and show the world mm. the power of laughter. Yes. So cross court How did it feel to receive the golden buzzer from him from Terry oh, Crews? Yeah, from that big show. It's 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 like a stamp of approval from someone in the Chika. industry. I this man has if you look at his biography, yeah, Baraga, yeah. the stuff he has mm-hmm. done. Mm-hmm. Huh? Yeah. So that person to come to him and say, "Dada, golden buzzer, approval." Here you go. Ah, anyway, and even Terry Crews is excited to mm-hmm. see me as I am. Yeah. I'm supposed to be excited to see it's what are you talking see, about exactly oh, yeah, no. no it's crazy Dara. Yeah. so it's just one of those blessings you know mm-hmm. like you know it's I've, I think God is just blessing the right people in my mm-hmm. in my life at yeah. the right time yeah um, so yeah uh, Terry Cruz mentioned you mm-hmm. you know you know took 14 mm-hmm. Our bus, mm. uh, yes, a bus ride from for five minute performances. Yeah. Yes, like what you said. Yes. What kept you? Uh, what what motive, motivated you mm. to keep going? Family, and also this is the only thing I had. Mm. There's nothing else. Koro, ah, chakaramba. Yeah. yeah. Right. So I only had this thing, comedy. Mm-hmm. So I had to I had to see through. There was no giving up. Yeah. There was, actually, there's there was no option mm-hmm. to give up. If I give up, I go back to Shimano and say. Ah, I know uh, and this thing has to succeed. Very true. Oh, well, there's something about persistence, Mdaraga. Yeah. If you go kubala bala and say, "Pane song we ayeku tukaenda kumurai ne mukaka." Mhm. Ne nyama. Ne nyama. Eh, wo so so. We say go get so ona. You focus on that thing. Yeah. Like I want this thing. Yeah. There are things who come. Yes, I've seen up. E pop and to pandru go enda. Oh, and I was just focused and I was inspiration mm-hmm. Trevor Noah you see Trevor Noah doing yeah. this thing you're yeah. like that's where I want to go exactly. right there. You see you see, you know and it's it's so nice you always have to have that insp- you know inspiration from mm. different people that mm. you look forward to you yeah. know. And yeah. yeah, that's what kept me going. You know, Simon mentioned he was uh, close to giving you the golden buzzer yes, as well, that, you know. How did that uh, you know feel knowing Simon is a hard critic yes to please it's crazy okay you know i didn't hear him on the actual audition when he said that because oh, yeah. you can't hear it really because oh. they were actually talking by themselves exactly but i wonder uh, you know, the actual pro- product mm-hmm. pandigipa tv and i heard him say that i was like what apa simon 
was shocked ndara 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 pinda and also after every performance you come to me up a stage yes and you yeah. kind of speak to me you be like uh-huh. i've never seen a comedian perform mm. with so much confidence and energy yeah. like you fill up the stage it's mm-hmm. a big stage and you yeah. just fill it up mm-hmm. that's it right there yes you know for it come from him mm-hmm. he seems so much comedy that he has seen so much talent mm-hmm. what does he say about dara iwe you know some people say that mm. you're not even funny you yeah. know uh you got the golden buzzer from Terry Crews mm. because of color mm. you know i mean okay. you, oh, what do you think about this my sentiments Did Elan, you, Mazimbos. didn't they just hear the we had or you time around the golden buzzer for it again don't 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 for it they just saw the video hey Simon got I, I was about to do that and hey. i was oh, no i got cut no but i'll tell you this mm-hmm. i comedy or in art yeah. itself you never satisfy anyone mm-hmm. everyone i mean yeah everyone there's no way mm-hmm. you satisfy everyone uh, the people that are saying that uh, you know, i was given the golden buzzer because of just my story mm-hmm. and yeah that's part of my product yes my story i go on stage and say i come from chimani man that's my story mm. it's a package that's why they put a video before your performance of yeah. you your history and yes. all of that yeah. because it's a story Mm-hmm. That's what I, it's a package. Yeah. So yes, mm-hmm. you are right. And <laughs> you are right. <laughs> <laughs> so your your performance was later you know, received with uh, mixed feelings and in dimi munoisa kufungwa dzi series dzokuvarungu. Remember when uh, Tiffany you mm-hmm. know uh, came to Zimbabwe. Exactly. Eh ito shamisi ko kona ndi ji ah to the market the grocery shop everything. So mm-hmm. and it's because of people like you. Interesting. And another kuti I attend my traffic lights it is it is some argue that uh, your jokes about mm-hmm. african you know stereotypes mm-hmm. uh, perpetuate harmful perceptions. I hear you. So okay. So how do you defend your comedic style? All right. Let me give you an example and it of a of a joke that insulted me. Mhm. And yeah. And why it insulted me. Mm-hmm. There's this meme that I saw. I mean, you know, like two two pictures. And yeah. I'm a European architecture. Right? But like a castle. Yeah. And like a but there's one African architecture. Mhm. But it's like a hut. And like <laughs> Exactly. And like that insulted me. Mm-hmm. Not because of the hut itself. Yeah. It's because that they don't understand that that hut mm-hmm was way ahead of its time. Yeah. There are kwa America they're trying to find ways to create uh to build houses with with things around them. Okay? A, a hut is warm when it's cold outside. Oh yes. It's cold self it's, it's you know self sustaining. Yeah, yeah, it's, true. It's, it's things that are around mm-hmm. you. That's the same thing mm-hmm. Americans are trying to do. Now. Now, medicine, our medicine. Yes, later. Is America is the medicine they have there? Yeah. Well, yeah. We've lost our culture. We are sh- ashamed mm-hmm. of who we are. Yeah. And mm-hmm. I'm saying this to say when white people or American tourists want to come to Zimbabwe to mm-hmm. experience Zimbabwe. Yeah. They don't want to experience another America in mm-hmm. Zimbabwe. Mm-hmm. They want to experience Zimbabwe in Zimbabwe. Mm-hmm. So when you when, when you say <laughs> Yes. That's what they want. Mm. Yeah, true. They want to come here mm-hmm. and experience Was that. Was wonera. I would love for us when we build houses to have our own African architecture yes. evo- in, included mm-hmm. in our houses yeah. to also include our culture in, 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 in everything, our education, mm-hmm. everything to really yeah. embrace and not become American or yeah. European and really be specific and and intentional mm-hmm. with the way we do things and be yeah. proud yeah. as Zimbabweans. Mm-hmm. When I say with Akuna traffic, I'm not dissing. Mm-hmm. I'm not. It's a reality. It's just reality and be proud of it. We don't need we don't need traffic lights, guys. Mm-hmm. That's not the that's not the, the you know the measure of success mm-hmm. or or to say no with the development. It's a traffic light. What is a traffic light going to help you with? You know, you can think Stephen Hadish came to say they are just ignorant because of this media in in america the, yeah. media, the media has always said that yeah. they are poor they are hungry and mm. they are they they are still doing it to today the most yeah. ignorant people about africa are the black people in america in america not because they it's because they don't know mm. 
the white people they are the ones with access to come to, to Africa and yeah. actually see Africa. Mm -hmm. Not the blacks. Not the blacks. They don't actually they have no idea. Mm. I've been asked the most ignorant questions yeah. by black people in America. Serious? Yes. Like what? Oh my god. So do you do you guys do you like go hunting like uh -uh. You're like, no. Man. Do you like wear clothes? Like, do you like, you know, <laughs> do, you do you speak like, oh, they see the koi sign. Yes. <laughs> and these are the African Americans. Hey. White people. They'll be like, mm. I was in Ghana. Yeah. You know, and this is not because, you know, white people can afford mm -hmm. to come to America. Mm -hmm. Dara, if you know how much money black people spend on Jordans every year in yeah. America, Ghana. Yeah. <laughs> no vunduka. No vunduka. No so yeah. what I'm trying to say here is it's not really I'm not dissing. Yeah. To them Americans. It's not it's just it's not, you. Yeah. And that was how do, how did you feel about Lenmo going to America's Got Talent mm -hmm. over at Kuchman Man to the higher? Yeah. Yeah. Ask them. Yeah. Oh, serious. And up party and no 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 quit a horse. Uh -huh. It's reality. It's, it's just reality. Maybe they're saying, yeah, it's, it is reality, mm. but maybe it's sometimes you're making funny you of, know, what? Of, mm. of it. Yeah, but that's like my... reality. Sort of, mm. uh, uh, example, mm. 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 Right. Mm. Mm. Yes. Then you go on a stage and say, ha, guys, mm. then, mm. then you yes, yeah. it's, it's real, yeah. but uh, is it funny? Yes, but here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing. So, comedy is always like that. Uh -huh. Look at all the comedians. It's laugh at my pain. Yeah. This is my pain. Oh, yeah. Laugh at it. Look at me. I have a lazy eye. Mm -hmm. Laugh at me. Yeah. You know, I'm suffering. I'm struggling. Yes. I have a joke about 2008 where mm -hmm. I say, guys, it was bad. Mm. You, I remember I got a haircut for two million. <laughs> And by the time the guy finished cutting my hair, it was twenty billion dollars. I finished. <laughs> <laughs> Don't start. You see, this is reality. This is things that we struggle yes. with. That's where comedy comes from. Yeah. Honor. Okay. And remember what I said: mm -hmm. to be able to make fun of someone else. Yeah. Make fun of yourself, yourself. first. Yeah. Now it makes sense. That's what you do. So now it makes I, sense. I talk about, I'm like, guys, Gwanru Vaga. Mawani. Mawani can. I see. Mawani. But to them, Mawani, they want nature. Yeah. Americans, they want, they, they have too much pollution. Mm -hmm. They want to come to a place like Shimani Mani where people drive like, Haya! where there's one traffic light, where people are so like, like the technology. And they got, mm -hmm. People in, in America, they're so on their phones like yeah. this. Well, there's yeah. too much light. There's too much. You want mm. to come to a place where there's 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 just nature. Yeah. Well, yeah, true. I'm literally I learned their their communication, mm -hmm. and I'm literally selling Shimani money to them. To them, yeah. But to you, you don't see it because you think development is a traffic light. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. It's not. Guys, I think so, I, I I think maybe our viewers now you understand. I hope so because yeah, now you understand. Let me give you another example. Mm -hmm. When Tiffany Haddish came and said, "Oh, they have supermarkets! Oh my God! Wow!" Put your money, money. I don't think a grocery. I know Kura Mota Yavo. I know Kamtar. Yeah. I don't think a grocery raw. Yeah, grocery go pick and pay. What do I have to beg with your money? Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> that distance, like <laughs> kilometers. I just don't know how to do it. I 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 don't know how to do I'm not saying Zimbabwe is, yeah. is, is like third world. I'm not yeah. saying that. Mm -hmm. I'm saying with Pandrukuva, Exactly. There's another village like that too. Mm -hmm. There's another. I'm representing someone else. I don't village. Yes, in true. And I, I cannot. I cannot speak specifically to you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's me. It's my story. Yeah. I have to be honest mm -hmm. with it. Honor. And also using it to also make fun of others. Great. Yeah. You faced uh, criticism for representing Africa yeah. in a negative you know, light through mm. your jokes. Mm. So how do you respond to these accusations? It's, uh, it's just how it is, man. It's, mm -hmm. there's no, you cannot hide from this. Yeah. You put, as an artist, you put out something out there. You're going to re re receive 
you know, feedback. Yeah. From diff that's just how it is. Mm -hmm. But I think my job is to start the conversation. Yeah. This conversation was started. Yeah. I think I've done my job. Very true. That's it. That's the job of an artist. Start the conversation. The conversation. Yeah. Now people are like, all right, what's the solution? Mm -hmm. How do we, you know, now that's the job. Exactly. And do you do you feel your your humor, mm -hmm. you know, which often touches uh, on African themes, mm -hmm. you know, alienates uh, certain audiences, especially mm -hmm. those from South Africa or mm -hmm. other you know, proud African nations? What do you mean? Like, like, like <laughs> explain yourself. Like, you know what? Mm -hmm. Mm. the humor do you feel it yes mm -hmm. you mean i do i feel the humor yeah yes i feel like so i've been based in south africa for yeah. a long time yeah. i i know the south african humor exactly well and actually part of my humor is yeah comes like there's little elements in my comedy yeah that comes from south africa too mm -hmm. you know in zimbabwe too <laughs> so I have so many friends in South Africa mm -hmm. that, that love my comedy. So yeah. I don't think it's actually alienates South Africans. Yeah. It, you know, it actually, you know, unites more. Yeah. Because I, I also talk about xenophobia in my comedy. Mm -hmm. I talk about how tough it was for me in South Africa as a Zimbabwean trying yes. to fit in. When I see a group of people coming, I try to be like, what are you my figure solo. <laughs> that's, that's all I know. Mbulekaya. My figure solo. Mbulekaya. Mbuet. Mbuet. Just try to fit in, you know. Exactly. So I'm telling my story, you know. It's, it's, uh, it's, uh, <laughs> I try to fit in. It's a Zimbabwean story based in um, in in South Africa. Yeah. And th there's another Zimbabwean, uh -huh. you know, relating to that. So I don't think it alienates. I talk about the Nigerians and how proud they are to be. You know, Nigerians are the most proudest African I've ever seen in my life. Mm. Very proud. They stand tall. They they know their culture. Yeah, you know, even unlike, the the dressing, everything. Yeah, everything. It's unlike us. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. our culture is lost. Yeah, most of our things we we we've lost. We want to copy what's happening. Very oh, true. Yes. Even the way we dress, the way we talk. You know, one, one, one thing I, I I liked, you know, when we were at the at the AGT, mm. all the competitions. You were putting on your 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 your, your, your African print jacket. Of course, of course. Was that intentional? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's me. Yeah. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if that some of the print comes from like Kenya. Yeah. Or you, Uganda. We are same people. I'm yeah. representing Africa, Africa. At, the of, at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. So it was definitely intentional. Even the people that were supposed to give me clothes, like the wardrobe at AGT, yeah. Yeah. I was like, no, I have my own stuff. Oh, the one that you give you. Yeah. I was like, they wanted to wear me to, they want me to wear, to wear like a leather jacket. Oh, yeah. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> leather jacket. No. No, let me put on my African. I print. have, I'm representing people back there. African fabric. Af African fabric. Yeah. On. And another thing that I want to talk about, Ola, before mm -hmm. I go, yeah. is Zimbabweans. We need to stop measuring somebody's intelligence by how well they mm. speak English. Oh, yeah. That thing is just so bad. Like you, somebody will be like, yeah, yeah well, uh, actually, you're like, ooh, actually. No, yeah. I've met some dumb English speaking people in my life. Yeah. Well, let's stop doing that. They are changing thing. accent. Changing accent. Trying you're to like, be American or, or the, British. Oh, 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 yeah, the smart no. no. There are these smartest in, in, in our language. Mm -hmm. Do you know how much sub substance is in mm -hmm. Shona? Yeah. Hi. Rich language. Rich language. Uka uka when a poem ye shona soga. You eh? Yeah, true. Lich literature ye shona mdaraga. Let's be proud, guys. Local is lacker. Local is lacker. Anyway. Mm, true. Mm. So what's next after this? You know, oh, now man. that you have qualified and you're in the mm. top five mm. AGT, what's mm. next? So yeah, so right now uh, AGT opens so many doors, and mm -hmm. uh, I'm doing a world tour. You know, I'll be announcing more, more, more dates very soon. I'm yeah. going to Australia. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm doing all of, all of Africa, you know, Europe. Mm -hmm. And then a bunch of TV stuff coming. Yeah. And there might be a, a Netflix something. Or not Netflix, really, but a, but a, something, something. a special thing mm -hmm. happening. Yeah. Like, you know, comedians do it like a special afterwards. Mm -hmm. You know, like, like an hour or so. Yes. So something like that is brewing. Mm -hmm. You know, it's going to be on one of those big platforms. Wow. You know, so yeah. And it's going to be... You know, same thing. I'll be talking about me and my mm -hmm. story because you know that's that's what's 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 needed out. That's what's lacking out there. Yeah. So, so did yeah. you make money out of this thing? Yeah, America's Got Talent. Yeah. No. Yeah. But the money comes from things around it. Oh, I see now. Because now, now, 
kanda embo charger five dollars ga zoro chinge ah nika ya chinge five dollars go talent nae five dollars ikuita sengo yo nae wana things have changed exactly wana so now you're changing you're revising your your red card you need to revise your red card and there's there's I've also been signed by by an agency wow. touring agency hey. for acting and you know whatever I'm yeah new, endo- new endorsements new endorsements you know there's brand opening, deals because yeah. there's people are paying attention yeah true well, they want to see what else you're going to do mm-hmm. i'm working on it like a little tv show that yes. i'm going to do very soon you yes. know what i mean mm-hmm. so yes it, oh, that's where the money comes from yes. people don't go to america to win mm-hmm. it mm-hmm. because you actually don't want to win it oh all right because if you win it my one you better stuck no stick on what's next yeah but no 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 it's the contract oh yeah of course of course oh, they, they, no they, because now you have to be in, in vegas for hey. for a year and you're not allowed to do any any other any stuff. other stuff. you know what i mean so yeah also after we know the ball i'm happy with it because i'm going to make way more and i'm going to be i'm going to have so much freedom i ah ku ya wana tutakwe kuzima kwa leso tenda ya wina then sana mboya that's what i'm going to do that's what i'm going to do ah so got to varana and i got to part ko So how often do you return to to Zimbabwe to to visit your grandparents and mm. how did they feel about your success? So I just got my green card so that means I can now travel back and forth. Yeah. yeah. So this is my first time after three years. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I, you're going to see me a lot mm-hmm. in Zimbabwe. The stuff I want to do back home. Um I, I really want to 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 give back to my village money money. Yeah. yeah. In terms of like, you know, just schools maybe buy some books. Mm-hmm. You know, um yeah and a lot i want to really do a lot so yeah. you see me going to chiman man mm-hmm. you know, so and today because yeah you know chiman man is yeah. an extension of me exactly mm. so what's your, uh, your your overall impression you know of the current state of the um, of the arts mm. and comedy in industry in zimbabwe first of all the comedy industry is in good hands mm-hmm. uh yesterday i got a workshop uh, uh, with uh, new comedians new faces i've mm-hmm. never seen you know these faces yeah and some of the acts are opened for me by shogo festival yeah ha ah, killed yeah and i'm like there's so much potential and i'm happy that most, some of the comedians are performing in shona yeah and that's just beautiful <laughs> yes. ah because we don't we all don't need yeah we don't we all don't need to be it's not so good in shona but shona it's actually it has more substance mm-hmm. than, than english, english stand up comedy mm mm-hmm. I'm so limited sometimes to go America because I mm. want to explain something then we have to know as you do the chat chat this is not substance yeah. it's just surface but with Shona it actually digs deep yeah. and it bring you know it's mm. got it's, it's more powerful yeah. so I was happy to see some but other... the only challenge you need to go to now wa jaira kuta in Shona when you got on on an international mm. international stage mm. you're stuck now yeah no it's 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 all about you know really learning how to adjust yourself and yeah. how fast you adjust in any mm. Prangana ko America oga it took me about 5 months yeah ji tsha le nga skubuda but dai so na unless that and then tunda so bata dai kuti all right paruda apa so all right and then mm. things are working out nicely yeah. Well. so yeah yeah mm. so do you believe kuti zimbabwe has enough you know room for stand up comedians uh, to thrive or is it still you know a growing space it it is growing of course I think at this point we need to create a good foundation. Mm-hmm. The good foundation is very important. Ah guys, we, we right now right now comedians are doing shows yeah. mm-hmm. but they just want off. Mm-hmm. It needs to be a thing that comes back all the time. Yes, true. It needs to be a culture. People have to be trained mm-hmm. <laughs> you know to be like ah comedy guys. Mm. Hand it to no one a comedy. Yeah. The, the idea of paying you know to yeah. laugh yeah. has to be normal. Because I, I saw the one that uh, Nijo did mm-hmm. recently mm-hmm. in in Arare, mm-hmm. you know, it, 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 it was a full house. Yes, I was like, what? People want comedy. Yeah. Yes, but the thing is now, Manjiga, your jokes are a product, mm-hmm. Andiga. Yeah. They have to be a good product. You go, you can't go. No, think a chingba or try to design one. So can naga pa 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 brand and all of that when mm-hmm. you see the photos with so many people exactly if the jokes themselves are good mm-hmm. people going to come back yeah they'll come back again oh, no. so yeah. that's the idea the, mm-hmm. me coming back and trying to you know give back to the guys let's, let's work like this so what what's your take on nijo's comedy i love nijo's comedy i'm a big fan yeah i'm a big fan of nijo king kandoro 
He's good. Those are my Those, guys. Ah, King and the West. And I'll tell you He's this good. for a fact to people out there. Mm -hmm. Whenever you see those you know, post that says, who is the best comedian? Mm. Just know that comedians name themselves, it's just, we are not even involved in any yeah. of that. Yeah. We actually don't even look at it. Mm -hmm. We are actually good friends behind the scenes. Behind the scenes, true. No beef, true. nothing. True. Me, King Kandoro, mm -hmm. Munashe, Doc Vikela, where's Sawa? Mm -hmm. Carl Joshua, Carl, shout out to Carl Joshua. Yes. He opened so many doors for me. True. To be international, mm -hmm. Carl Joshua, mm -hmm. I'm not going to lie. Right? I, Dara, he if, if, you the see, way. if you see how he used to do, like the, the shows he used to do around yeah, the world. Around the world, yes. In, bra, I, I was like, I want to do that. I took that exactly. blueprint and I put it, you know, mm. because he opened those doors for yes. me. Yes, you know? yes. So we actually get along. Mm -hmm. It's just that the social media is social like... Social media, of course. Yeah, I like it's like, You know, the beef, you know? <laughs> 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 don't put it on the papi. We don't do it on the papi. King and Doro. <laughs> Alfred Kainga, you know, uh, he's, he's, he's an American. my guy. Uh, I hosted him some time ago here yes, on, on this show. He's my friend. Because Drindega ko America. Yes. Alfred is the closest I have. But Anton Funa sometimes randomly in the middle exactly, of the night. Exactly. Dara, who just say go? You know, Dara is my friend. We are nice. actually very close. Nice. Oh, no, man. And the Mukure Soros is going to be good to go. It's amazing. Ah, no, 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 Dara. No, no, no. Now, you know, as we wrap up, mm. I want to talk about that, uh, you know, tragedy. Yetakaita mm. Kuchi Mani Mani. Yes. Uh, past few years. Mm -hmm. I understand it's close to your to your place. Like it's it's like it's my place. Like it's your place. That's it right there. I actually lost some people there. Yes. How did that affect you? Oh my God! I was still in South Africa, mm -hmm. and the news came in when I was about to go on stage. Mm. Uh, and the Cape Town Comedy Club. It closed because of uh, COVID. Uh, and. I only heard the news. Mm -hmm. and I'm trying to call my grandparents. Ah, and mm -hmm. store that network. Nothing. Yeah. I'm about to go on stage. Hey. How do you be? How do you how can you be funny? You can't be fine. It's just tough. You want to make people laugh. But you you know, yes. it was tough, man. Yes. It was tough. Because yes. for like a, I think it's a week, I couldn't mm -hmm. get in touch with my grandparents. Mm. I couldn't even go there because of the roads were destroyed and everything. Ah, it was stressful, mm. Dara. Stressful. Mm. By the time I went there to see what had happened, yeah, ah, yeah. tears because because ah, these are places I used to walk exactly. to school all the time. Now the atmosphere, the environment. You see a building, change. building I used to see every day. Pastor in a pastor in the ground, just ah, where is the building gone? That was tragedy. So the thing about my grandmother, she's a writer. She wrote a book about cyclone and die. Mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, how people deal is dealing with it, you know, and yes. she's also kind of kind of like a therapist also mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to the people that struggled with uh, post traumatic, yes. you know, syndrome. Events, yeah. So, you know what I mean? So she really is a strong woman in the community. She's mm -hmm. really involved, hands on. Yeah. And I, I applaud her for that. Yeah. She's really amazing. Mm. So yes, um, it was a tragedy, and mm. uh, I think we are recovering yeah. bit by bit. I hope we g we're gonna have like infrastructure that can help you know when this thing happens again because when i was a, when i was young yeah it was another cyclone mm. i remember that this. side yes hey. and i remember trees falling like buildings you know destroyed and i remember it was crazy yeah yeah i, I don't know so it's a, it's a place which is prone to yeah but it happens really after a lot of years yeah oh, so mm -hmm. i think we need to start thinking about mm -hmm. you know like how when it happens again how are we gonna help yeah people you know yeah so anyways thank you so much my brother i appreciate and, you and uh, do you believe you are living up to your name learn more and <laughs> what uh, have you learned oh your, my god your comedic journey? oh my god learn more i, I don't think i'll ever <laughs> live up to my name learn more <laughs> can i tell you why my name is learn more for real yeah so in any growing up, I'm going to learn more because I don't do this. Yes. But I've stumbled it. I don't know if I'm going to send a message to my mom's through your name. Mm -hmm. through your name. Mm -hmm. your name. Yes. So my mother had me when she was young. Mm -hmm. So my name is a message oh, Okay. to my mother to always remind her okay. to learn more. Mistakes. Oh, that was the message. <laughs> yes. Ah. <laughs> but my sister now, she was born, so you know, you know her name. Exactly. Learned nothing. Learned, uh, I'm just. Uh, <laughs> <laughs>
and my other brother we give up he's right there now i'm just like <laughs> he's, right he's right there give up we give up yeah i give up <laughs> exactly your name <laughs> but, but, you know i don't know how these parents you know came up with this ah uh, iwe but we start to go na mo inesu na mo inesu my we zangu take it easy actually i used to have a t- take it easy growing up yeah Take it easy. Take it easy, bro. And the angas ne angas ka. I angas ka na. I think I think we are going to go to Zaraga. Opa ma ma zidaga. E ma situations we are going to. Oh, exactly. Tambudzai. Hey, ah, we are tambudzai. O ti tambudzai. Ye tambudzai u. Ah, guys. It's just crazy. It's crazy, man. So, um, you know what? Mm-hmm. Apart from comedy, mm-hmm. what else do you do? Um, so I do I design most of my stuff you know like um my posters you know I do a lot of uh stuff that you will see me wearing yeah yeah, you know, yeah. I, 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 I have my hand in those too okay yeah my videos are on the internet there yeah. I edit myself wow you know I'm, I like doing stuff myself and mm-hmm. I film making you know yeah. I love film making mm-hmm. one mm-hmm. thing that I really want to pursue and also build up on mm-hmm. so yeah I'm creative That's great. Yes. So, your parting remarks, mm. maybe any uh, uh, upcoming um, projects or goals? Yes, you um, want to share with the, our, our viewers. Yeah, manje manje tinti ba Pornhub. Finish it my my it's a serious I don't want to tinti ba tinti ba but I want to tap a shot. I just see that on coming. Why, why, anyway, yes. it's okay. No, it's okay. No, I'm just, uh, no, 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 don't believe anything. Everything I say. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, right now, I'm like I said, I'm working on a tour. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm I'll come back to Zimbabwe very soon, yeah. and we we'll do like a proper show. Okay. And I would love to bring my friends that I've met out there mm-hmm. to come and do comedy yeah. here, and mm-hmm. also, like, imagine like a comedian from mm-hmm. America coming here and teaching. You know yeah. the you know the young comedians mm-hmm. here how things work there yes. and how he writes jokes. Mm-hmm. When I do that exchange, maybe mm-hmm. a Zimbabwe comedian goes there mm-hmm. and do an exchange. So yeah. yeah, very soon I'm gonna start doing that, and then yeah, that's it. And ch- now right now I'm off to Chimani Mani to see an Agoga. An Agogo, exactly. But out, out of you know just you know curiosity, most of the my comedians, we don't know what they're doing. Always you know jovial. I do not sing with Dara. So good Dara. Ah, you, 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 you. Do not sing. Papa, I'm marrying you. Papa, you, you. I don't sing with you. I'm marrying you. And I'm marrying you. No, but yes, because good song. I'm digging. Don't go no back comedy. Okay. One of if you dig deep into good song, like I told you about my father. Yes. That drove me. To what to pin that about? To pin exactly. So you need that. That's life. Mm. Somebody else is going through that. So if you talk about it, it's therapy to me. Yeah. Talk about that. It's mm-hmm. therapy to me. It's therapy to you. Oh yeah. So yes, we use it. So your your, your message to parents mm. who are failing or who neglected, mm. you know, their their children, mm. but they are surviving there. Mm. Their children are doing something, something else, else. Mm. elsewhere. I would like to say, reach out. You know, reach. Out. You'll be surprised. By by uh, like the the love they you know they'll give g- give you mm-hmm. some 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 you know that, like me mm-hmm. they've already give forgiven you yeah you know all you need to do is just reach out yeah you know and just be like oh yeah you know and just you know receive the the I forgive you yes that's all it is mm-hmm. you know it's never too late it doesn't matter if the person is now has gray gray exactly. hair exactly never too late you don't have to hold on to that grudge for don't forever. hold on to that grudge it's it's, it's only going to work against you mm. you know both for both sides yeah. you know you know you all have to just forgive each other yes. and just move on mm-hmm. and now i don't take these things for granted mm-hmm. i'm very you know particular like i want to be the best father for mm-hmm. my children yeah oh, no wow so yes <laughs> thank you so much uh, lenmo for i having. appreciate you right yes this was fun i i, I Uh-uh. Absolutely, I enjoyed it. Well, thank you for, for inviting I, I me. I enjoyed, I enjoyed it. Mm. And next time, I want to be in America with you. Yes, yes. Talk about my visa, guys. Talk about my visa. You take this, take some visa. Your story just reminds me, uh, reminds me of um, Temba Gorimbo, how he met the. Oh, wrong. Tem is killing it. Just Temba. Shout out to Temba. He's killing it. Yeah, yo. true. True. He's killing it. Yeah.
Thank you so much, guys, for watching you. our viewers. We mm. appreciate you guys. Mm. And uh, keep on supporting mm. the, the podcast. Keep on supporting. Learn more, Jonasi. Chibomira is us. Chibomira is our guy. Our guy. Yes. So thank you so much, guys. You wanted to say something? No, Andre Boy. Bye-bye. You're thank good. you for... Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. And I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Okay, guys, until next time. I'm yes. DJ Ola 7 Owen. <laughs> <laughs> We're covered on the bye bye signing out. the little things that make us giants in our industry. We put in that extra mile of service so your car can go that extra mile of performance. Our aim is to make our stopovers feel like home. Giant Petroleum. Limitless Energy.